before the treatment process. It isn't easy viewing, but that's the point. We're try not trying to traumatise the kid, but we're trying to give them a reality. We know bushfires can be unimaginably destructive and dangerous, yet many who light them haven't learned that yet. All children are fascinated by looking at an open fire or, or, a, or a campfire or something. Um, it's quite natural, but it's when they start playing with it that we really need to take steps to address it. That's where the Juvenile and Family Fire Awareness Program, known as JAFA, comes in. Well, JAFA is an education program aimed at six to 16 year olds who have giant fire lighting tendencies. Run by DFES, it tailors each session using a range of resources, from a video showing how fast fire can spread, to images of burn victims like Ben Smith, who in 2001, when he was just eight years old, started a fire that burned more than half his body. They, I guess, have are, are treading on thin ice in terms of going down dangerous path and there are legal consequences of lighting fires as well. Research internationally shows that predominantly people who deliberately light fires are young males. And while Dr Gately says the reasons behind their fire starting are varied, most can be turned around. Once people's behaviour gets very entrenched, it's harder to treat. So once they get into adulthood, it's why it's very, very important for us to target the kids. If we can steer those uh, children away from that sort of bad behaviour and, and back on the, on the right path, um, that to me is a really a good reward. Jaffa is a free service and concerned parents or even school teachers are urged to make the call.